ahead and try to pull the full lighting together. I tried to make another video, but this, this software is very incompetent. It doesn't allow you to like record and switch to other apps so that you can like read something. It just auto disconnects for you, which makes no sense whatsoever. And I am not a fan of Twitter. Twitter is incompetent too. It's just now I'm starting to understand why everybody was so pissed off about Twitter is because of this weird psychological illness that people have there to like ferment their hypocrisy. And so there's this guy, uh, there's a lot of just networking on Twitter. And Twitter networks against constitutional freedoms. And they love hypocrisy. You go on there and you call somebody a moron. And they're talking about anti-constitutional freedoms. So I don't need to elaborate to you. I'm just going to say that to you. Are you going to remove my comment rather than uh, try to elaborate and understand why you're a fucking moron? No, you're never going to do that. You're just going to say it's an insult or something and try to get me banned. So this is, this is hypocrisy at its Heinous. This, this guy is like, uh, my family owns guns. I shoot guns. The NRA doesn't speak for us. And in another post, uh, hard to swallow pills and this meme and it says the NRA uh, values guns more than your your children. The psychological manipulation, the propaganda manipulation is just embarrassing if you really can point these things out if these people can handle it because you're, you're literally going to start telling them to go sit over there and let the grown-ups talk one national rifle association does not deal in the safety of your fucking children i've already made another video explaining it of how okay now we're breaking off topic here it's just <laughs> So the hypocrisy here is that the NRA doesn't speak for us. So he's trying to undermine and underwrite the NRA so he can speak for us. You understand? If you can follow that, that if if they if the NRA is speaking for us, which they don't, they speak for you know uh, whatever the fuck they are. They're a clan. They don't make any sense to me. I I don't join them. It's just. <laughs> You have another guy that's like, oh, we need to get rid of these people so that I can speak for you. And it explains to you why they're wrong. And it's always just this, like, climbing above one another to pretend that you are self-righteous. It's self-righteous, self-indulgence, and hypocrisy. And this is everywhere. It's everyone. Every single fucking person. If... Somebody has something to gain. Typically, it's those three fundamental structures of philosophy that are creating this issue. And, you know, there's always that other opposite paradox. But aside from going into all that, I, was trying, I went off on another side talk about that mother, right? That, that she doesn't know how to defend her own family. She doesn't know how to defend her, herself, her, her children and is blaming other people for the freedom that she doesn't know how to utilize it's it's really strange that just because you have a child a lot of people emphasize this just fragility and right over you and it, it, it's not necessarily like i'm not going to run through a child that's just standing in a store right it's more like I'm going to try to teach this child, like, how to be aware of your surroundings. And that is the difference. If I walk and this child is, if you have a, a constant, let's, let's say that you have one, which you typically don't. And so you have to let you know, people like me understand that I can, under, I can analyze the scenario and understand that like, this, this child is mentally incompetent to understand their own scenarios and their situations to which you just come up with the same roundabout issue is that we could literally lim limit the rights for you to vote because you are mentally inferior you you could no longer if we eliminated eliminated humanity 
could I enunciate? Humanity today. Replace the, the future with... I mean, could you rewrite the Constitution? Do you really fucking think you're that goddamn brilliant? So why do you think that you can erase constitutional freedoms? I am very capable of philosophy, and I don't even think that I'm brilliant enough, right? And these are the greatest philosophers of the modern era. Since the Industrial you know, Revolution, why do they ever call it that? I don't know. Industrial Revelation. <laughs> It's just, you're not that fucking good. Just because there's more of you does not mean anything, man. It's the paradox of democracy where the greater good is often the lesser good and the lesser good is often the greater good. You have to understand these things. It's very fucking complicated. But to vote against constitutional freedoms, you would literally need a new house of representatives that are capable of thinking at the basic level of the founding fathers to which now you are coming out and saying just because you got your dick off for the last 300 years that you can shoot a gun and he doesn't even shoot it well i mean he can't even i'm watching that fucking blue rock and it's flying across the fucking sky and i'm like i, sh I could hit that thing when i was 10 years old i was five years old when i you know i still remember trying to hit a pheasant i didn't even know you had to lead the target back then so this guy's like this thing is pew. And he's like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You're gonna let people like that decide your own fucking safety? No, these are people in fear of position that understand that they have the power to remove your freedoms because they think in terms of fear of the people like us that might limit their freedoms. Which means that they are recognizing this weakness in themselves. So they are trying to exploit it. They're lying to themselves is what it is. And you have people. I'm trying to correlate all those little par It's fucking wild man. That. The other videos. That may really elaborate on this. I've had some wrong. It's just. When you break it all down. You're not that fucking good okay you really aren't you're just self-righteous self-indulged and you're a fucking hypocrite 